the people affected by the conflict are mostly indigenous Mexicans whose ancestors were living here long before the Spanish arrived, 500 years ago. A third of the people in this part of Mexico don't even speak Spanish. Corn has been part of their culture for centuries and they've been preparing it in the same way since Mayan times. I dropped in on Maria Pathistan, an indigenous rights campaigner who'd promised to show me how to make tortillas the traditional way. The only problem was we were running a bit late. Really? We're so sorry we're so late. We have some flowers for you. I'm so sorry. I am Stefan. Hello. <laughs> Maria's daughter and granddaughter were already at work on the tortillas. They seemed a little surprised to see me in their kitchen. None of these women are really very keen on me cooking at all. But it's clearly not a job for a, for a bloke. So, so now I have to spread it out. Yeah. Do I need to turn, keep turning it round? <laughs> it's circular. It's vaguely circular. <laughs> They're laughing with, with nervous fear because they know that I'm going to be good. Look at this, not bad. <laughs> it's a bit skewy. They've all got different techniques. That's why I'm getting confused. The grandma was saying, yeah, he's a guy. The discs of corn dough are heated on a griddle over a wood fire until they start to brown. OK, I might have to have a little try. It's not too different from the other ones. <laughs> OK. Tell me what you think. <laughs> Tell me what you think of my yeah. one. It's very good. It's very good. It's very good. I get the sense they're flattering me. And they're kind of thinking, get out of my kitchen. <laughs> It was a good job she liked my tortillas because what Maria hadn't told me was that she had an interesting sideline as a witch. Okay, look at this, the inner sanctum. A oh, very strong smell of incense in here. Witches are actually pretty common around here. Every town in Mexico has at least one and they claim to be able to sort out everything from back problems to jealous lovers. Maria's noticed that I'm a bit spiritually mucky and she wants to give me a thorough cleansing with the help of the Virgin Mary, various spirits and some eggs. Despite this beating, I was actually beginning to feel strangely calm. Thank you very much. I, do, I feel very different. <laughs> I feel I'm tingling. As I left, I realised that I'd never told her I had any daughters. Hey. Maria's just nipped off to make a, a um, spiritual phone call. Uh, no, she hasn't. She's <laughs> nipped off to sort her son out with some petrol. Um, and this is great. She's given us her CV. It's the first time I've ever seen a, a witch with a CV. With pictures and everything. Haven't times changed? <laughs> not a not hundred years ago, we'd be dipping her. <laughs> 